Hello, we are Tavon and David from TD Adventures. We are at Acadia National Park. Today, we are on our way to visit Sand Beach, Thunder Hole, Ocean Path, also known as Cliff Walk, and the Lighthouse. You can click the links below if you missed our earlier videos when we saw the beautiful sunrise at Cadillac Mountain, the beautiful sunset at the Oceanside Bar Harbor KOA campground, and the crazy and scary hikes that we did at the Beehive Trail, Beach Trail, and Bubbles Trail. This is where you show your entrance ticket, but today is a fee-free day. We drive right by, which means the park is going to be crazy busy. We have the National Park Pass and just happened to be here on the free entrance day. Yeah, I think this is Beehive Trail. To the right, where all the cars are parked, is where the Beehive Trail starts. Looks like parking is blocked off at the trailhead. We have arrived at the Sand Beach parking lot. Over there is where you climb the Beehive Trail. Glad we did that hike in 2017 and we are not doing that again. Too scary. I still recall First time I saw you, I was so nervous to talk. Happened so fast, went from so lonely to falling asleep. According to this article, Sand Beach is what's called a natural pocket beach, about 300 yards wide, tucked at the northern end of Newport Cove between Great Head and the beehive. It's actually only about half sand. The rest of the beach is made up of crushed bits of mussel and crab shells, sea urchin spines, and parts of other sea creatures. I used to be afraid to fall in love. My past relationship was a disaster, but now the seaweed. Say it again, David. A about very the seaweed. Fresh. So, yeah. The waves must have brought it up, right? Henry. Hurricane Henry brought it up. Right? I think so. Right after visiting the sand beach, we wanted to check out Thunder Hole, but it was too foggy, so we came back the following day. We arrived early, and we were able to park in the parking lot right across from Thunder Hole. This is what it was like when we visited in the summer of 2017. You may wonder why this place is called Thunder Hole. According to this article, Thunder Hole is a small inlet naturally carved out of the rocks where the waves roll into. At the end of this inlet, down low, is a small cavern where, when the rush of the wave arrives, air and water is forced out 
like a clap of distant thunder. Water may spout as high as 40 feet with a thunderous roar, hence the name Thunder Hole. When we arrived at Thunder Hole, we saw this sign. We think this is because of the effects from Hurricane Henry, which was later downgraded to a tropical storm. It looks calm now, but here is how it could have been. Definitely not safe to be down there. They're walking along the ocean path, also known as the cliff walk. Walking out on the rocks to do some exploring. Check out the tour boat going by. You can get on this tour boat at Bar Harbor, which we will show in the next video. shade and rested for a bit. Going back to our RV to make a bathroom stop. The park is very busy now. What do you want to do? Maybe we go out and say, 10 bucks a piss. <laughs> 50 if you have to do the other. <laughs> That's one expensive, number one, number two. And payment in advance. Yeah. <laughs> and? It's good to see people enjoying the national parks. Yeah. Okay. We had planned to do more exploring, but it was just too crowded. So we were heading out. The couple that was able to get our parking spot was so happy. We remember standing in that long line yeah. in 2017. Yeah. Okay. So thankful to have our own bathroom now. Long line, the bathroom. Busy. What time is it right now? It's like 
And it's a madhouse, right? Mm -hmm. We're getting out of here. This is a nice day. The day after the hurricane, not a good day to come. We thought it was a great day to come. Yeah, there was nobody here. Yes. This is the view on our way out. Look at that. That's a nice view. It's just getting a little hot. Look those shades right here. Looks good. I want you to take this off now. Yeah. Oh, I have to take it to get repaired. Lunch is our next destination. at the Travelin Lobster twice. It is only open from Tuesday to Friday, from 12 to 3.30 or until sold out. All the seafood are fresh catch from the morning. The food is very good here, as you can see by the long line. The sun can get very hot while waiting in line, so I brought an umbrella with me on the second visit. Nice umbrella, eh? It's a good umbrella. It's a good idea to have an umbrella. It's very hot. Very hot. Especially if you're standing in line. Yes. There was a really long line the other day. It was. It was indeed. Yeah. Was. Both visits, Tavon had lobster and clams, and I had a hot dog and grilled cheese, because I am not a big fan of lobster. Here is Tavon's meal, before and after. Yum, yum. When the Travelin Lobster Stand is not open, we check out this lobster place, which is not far from our KOA campground. Like, what are these here? Now three quarter to two. This wow. one's two and a half. Those are Ooh. three pounds. Wow. And these are the soft shells? No, these are hard. These are hard shells. That one's a pound and a quarter. Whoa. That one's a pound and three quarters. What do you think? That go with that one. Go with that one. One? Just one. Just one, yeah. We'll, we'll be coming back again. That's all right. Tomorrow, yeah. Eat one every day? You yeah, want? there you go. I think that's what we'll do. Like a recipe Look Eat at that. One a day, a number 50. <laughs> okay. I like your rim. You like your rim? Yeah. Oh, yes. Love it. Love it. Small enough. Yeah. Oh, 20 minutes. Oh, 20 minutes? Okay, thank you. Yep. I like it. Someone said your name had a ton of room. Suddenly, you're there. So, here's my lobster, number 50. Everything comes back in the blink of an eye. It's like your mom. So, what happened? You ended up having to help me. Yeah, this lobster, uh, very, very tough. The shell, shell is very hard. Very, very hard. I and it. Uh, this is the bare minimum. A much better cracker would go a long way, but you know, it's just mm -hmm. can't get a lot of. Get a lot of I could not pressure. get it open. You had to help me. Yeah. And you're not really big on seafood. No. You must really love me. Thank you. You're welcome. Still working on the lobster. And here's the tail. This lobster is much larger than what Tavon usually orders, and she said it tasted salty. Is this because it has been in the ocean longer, or because of the water it was boiled in? What do you think?
making our way to see the sunset at the Acadia National Park Lighthouse. The park is still very busy because it is a free entrance day. After sitting still for a long time, Vaughn got out of the RV and started walking toward the lighthouse. I will join her later once I am able to park. Yeah. Tomorrow I can be like a tree in the wind. Same old roots, but I can bend. Turning to understand and sway together. stairs for the lighthouse view. Now it's almost like a dance, rendering of stubbornness, and it just cuts us deeper through. 2017 Visit After a long wait, I was finally able to park the RV. I made it. 